Run. Hello guys, welcome back to a new video. Today we are going to murder... Wait, no, that wasn't part of the script. We are going to be playing the Banana Game Show. Shovelware Studios proudly presents a production filmed live on our studio lot at Shovelware Studios Hollywood. It's Shovelware's Brain Game! Don't adjust your TV set, that's just how he looks. Here's the Dancing Banana! Flags of the World How many stripes are there on the flag of the United States of America? That's no good. Big laundry. So I've heard that Americans have this thing called a 10-gallon hat. <laughs> Do you think anyone has tried to actually fill it with water before? I mean, how many gallons of water can it hold, really? Taste test. Your tongue has taste receptors. Yeah. That tell your brain the flavors of things that touch your tongue. There are five basic tastes that those receptors pick up and combine to form all sorts of complex flavors. Which of the following is not one of the five basic tastes? I don't like that. I don't like characters whose shoes point up in fiction. Which type of character is often depicted with pointy-toed shoes in various pieces of media?
Shovelware Studios. <laughs> In Shrunken School Lobby, you're chased through the shrunken sewers by the infrigerator. How many holes does the dastardly contraption punch through the ceiling and walls during its pursuit? Probably geography. Oh, help! I'm going over Niagara Falls in a barrel! Did you know that Niagara Falls is actually three separate waterfalls? I think I'm going down the largest one! What was the name of it again? I give up. Cabbage! And the cheap kind too! Look. I only had so much budget to get these prizes together, okay? This was gonna be my dinner! Here's our Shovelware's Brain Game! I have no idea how I just won that. Well, a win's a win, I guess. We'll be right back after a two-minute break that we're hoping you'll stick around for to boost player retention and playtime metrics! This episode is sponsored by Lazy Brand Lazy Obstacles, the leading supplier of red plastic rectangles that can sometimes be interpreted as lava. Speaking of which, you should play my hobby sometime. I worked really hard on it, you know. We've been filming non-stop for weeks, and at this point, I honestly kind of just want to go home. But instead, I'm here announcing that it's time for Shovelware's Brain Game! He's bright, he's yellow, and more than a little off-putting, your host, the Dancing Banana! Trains, planes, and automobiles. What is another name for the tail of an airplane?
Science rules. There's a part of the cell known as the powerhouse because it generates energy for the rest of it. What is its name? Shapes and such. Which of these is not a real shape? Science rules. What is the freezing point of water? I'm trying to freeze some right now, and it's just, you know, normal cold water, which is fine, but it's not what I'm looking for. Help me out, would you? We're friends, right? I consider us friends anyway. Hey, don't give me the cold shoulder. You know, I was just reminded... <laughs> to put in the effort and you run, I mean, those are really difficult hobbies that I... <laughs> <laughs> so if anybody wants to trade up, I'm, I'm around. Oh, now I'm hungry. Artistic integrity. <laughs> You're going to Brazil. That's right. You and your whole family are going to Brazil. Explore the sights and sounds of South America on this six-month-long mandatory excursion to Rio de Janeiro that you cannot back out of. I repeat, you will be locked into this obligation with absolutely no way out. This cannot be undone if you win this prize. All these normal questions have me pretty bored. You know who isn't bored, but is a bored? Here with our special guest question, it's Bordy the Smart Bored! Which camera am I looking at again? Oh, hey! It's me, Bordy! Question time! Take a look at these colors. You have the primary colors of pigment, but then they overlap and make other colors. What's the name for these colors created by the primary colors mixing? <laughs> well, I fulfilled my duties. Bye for now.
It's lit, fam! <laughs> Take a look inside my twisted mind! I've concocted my very own original character. An evil, nasty version of the classic literary character, Dr. Jekyll. It's never been done before. I'm a genius! Now, what would the name of this sinister alter ego be? The Friendly Burger Little Friends Meal! Except for the toy, because I want the toy, so I'm keeping it. It came with apple slices though, and I don't really like apple slices, so you can have those. Yeah. You did it! You've got the biggest brain of all! I have no all. idea how I just won that. Well, that a win's a win, I guess. Of brain game to a close. Give me a few minutes to scrounge up a grand prize for the next round, then we'll be back for another episode! Extra pepperoni. 30 minutes or it's free? Hey, great! That's... Oh, oh, it's a Shovelware's Brain Game! <laughs> he's not a horror game mascot. He just seems inherently evil because he's participating in late-stage capitalism. It's the Dancing Banana! I don't like that. Which phobia is the fear of repeating patterns and clusters of small holes? You've just posted cringe. Math Zone! <laughs> the Tiger Poster! What is ten times ten? Super! <laughs> <laughs>